Navian staple on Lake Street is marking a huge milestone this year. Inga Bretson's Nordic Marketplace is celebrating its 100th year in South Minneapolis. Fox 9's Karen Scullin paid them a visit to find out their secret hmm. to survival. What are we going to start with today? The meatball mix and Swedish sausage draw the crowds. During Christmas season, uh, we go through about a thousand pounds of meatball mix a day and a thousand pounds of Swedish sausage a day. Have you ever stood in line before? Oh yes, many yeah. times. Is right. it worth it? Yes. <laughs> and customer loyalty is what Inga Bretsons cherishes the most. You've been coming here a long time. My whole life. Yeah. <laughs> It's why owner Julie Ingebretson says they're still here after 100 years. You know, people have been so supportive of us for, for all of these years. They just keep coming back even though they've moved out of the neighborhood. They come back, their kids come back. To mark the 100th anniversary, Ingebretson's has been posting customer loyalty stories on social media, like this one from a Scandinavian in Texas. He writes, our challenge was where we would find the lutefisk in Texas. That begun a tradition of 30 plus years when someone in our group would make a trip to Minnesota to visit Inga Bretson's to pick up the lutefisk and bring it back to Texas. But as deep into culture and tradition as Inga Bretson's is now, it really wasn't that way when Julie's grandfather opened up in 1921. You know, when so many of the, those first generation people came over, they wanted to be American and uh, proud of being where they came from, but, but still more focused on being fitting in here and uh, and so it's been the succeeding generations that have valued the roots of this more, more and more. While a lot of customers come for the things that haven't changed, they also come for the things that have, like the gift shop here that was added in the 70s. Local and international Nordic artists have filled the store with unique Scandinavian finds that are both beautiful and fun. Are these, uh, are those mountain goats or rams or whatever it is? They are goats. They are goats. They're goats they are also. goats. Okay. It's called a Yule, Yule buck. What is it? A Yule buck. A Yule buck. Like many businesses on Lake Street, Inga Bretson's faced some challenges through COVID and social unrest. But just like they have since 1921, the customers still keep showing up. What do you think your grandfather would say today if he saw the store and the success and, and its uh, survival. What a good question. He'd be very proud. I know he would. In South Minneapolis, Karen Scullin, Fox 9.